The snow has finally arrived, but for winter athletes, their training starts well before the snow is on the ground. TV6's Houghton Hancock Bureau reporter Gabrielle Mays was with a cross-country ski team on Wednesday when it was sunny and warm to find out how they train without snow. Before the snow starts to fall, cross-country skiers have to practice without it. This is Becca Lyle's first year on the high school Copper Country Ski Tigers team, but she's been a skier for over five years. I was in Ski Tigers when I was young. I was like five or six, maybe. And then it just kind of progressed, and I just enjoyed skiing a lot. And when the opportunity came to be on the middle school and high school teams, then I just kind of took it because I liked racing. Coach Tom Wood says it takes a lot of practice and dedication to be a cross-country skier. Well, the kids are training close to 500 hours. Some are actually a little over 500 hours a year. We have to put in quite a lot. So, um, we practice on Monday, Tuesday, Thursday, and Saturday. And we practice basically year-round except for when you can't run or ski. And when it comes to practicing during this time of year when there isn't any snow, they do a lot of running and another exercise called bounding. These poles are used to imitate ski technique. It helps condition the arm muscles and the core muscles to help propel the skiers forward. There are 24 students on this race team and they travel across the country to compete. We don't use uh, downhill ski areas, so we travel using skis through the woods, uh, trails through the woods. In Hancock, Gabrielle Mays, TV6 News.